All right, so here's how I set up my quizzes for lesson plans for faculty. So I'm on my faculty page. I'm going to click uh, on quizzes. You'll see that I've already created uh, a bunch of quizzes. I've got one that I've already started to work on. So we'll call this uh, unnamed quiz. Uh, but you can just hit add quiz. I need to edit this. So I'm going to call it Lesson Plans uh, Week 19. That'll be the week we come back from school. Down here, I'm going to get put some instructions. Please uh, upload your lesson plans by Monday at 8.30 a.m. Then I'm going to scroll down. It's a graded quiz. Uh, it's in the assignments. It's not a big, that stuff's not a big deal. Uh, all this stuff is not stuff that I, I ever mess with. Uh, this is the big thing down here. I want it due by January the 4th at 8.30 a.m. So what that does is at that time it, it will close the quiz and anybody that posts after it it will uh, designate it as late. It's available anytime you can if teachers want to go ahead and work ahead of schedule they can do that. Also uh, I'm gonna go up here to questions and I want a new question. So what is my question gonna be? Please upload your lesson plans to this quiz. Now I want to go down. Uh, you don't have to do the type of question it is. Uh, I always go up here, question, and it's going to be a file upload question. Each one is worth one point. So uh, making it, I'm going to update the question you'll see that this is what it'll look like on your uh, Canvas page. So for my teachers, you have teachers with multiple preps. They may be teaching pre-AP, um, just different options. And so once you have uploaded one question, all I have to do is go to Find Questions, and I want to uh, add these questions to the quiz. It's already there. Um, just hit add question and it'll keep adding. I have some teachers that have up to five uh, lesson plans they want to upload. It's always easier to do it that way. So we've got our questions. So I'm just gonna add uh, my three for right now so that we can move forward. When I'm done, I hit save and publish. And this is what it'll look like. They'll see this, or if you wanna see what the quiz is, you can hit preview. This is what the teachers will see. They can click on a file, upload it from their desktop, and they're done. So a lot of, lot of neat options to do. Uh, when I want to go look at grades for those teachers to see if someone submitted the, the quiz, here's their lesson plans. So they get points. Mine are usually out of five. I usually have five questions. Uh, and you can go in and click and see what the lesson plans are. I can see exactly who has not turned anything in in one fell swoop. If it's in pink, it tells me it's a late submission that they did not turn them in on time. Hope this helps you. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, it's fairly easy if you get in and play with it a little longer.